You wake up, ready to sync your latest workout data with your Garmin device, only to find that Garmin Connect is down. The smartphone app is unresponsive, and the website dashboard isn't loading either. You quickly realize you're not alone in this predicament. Users across multiple countries are facing the same issue, and the company has yet to issue an official statement. This isn't just a minor glitch or a temporary hiccup. It's a significant outage affecting a large user base. Unfortunately, these types of things happen. While it might be tempting to recall past incidents like the hacking of Garmin's servers a few years back, it's more constructive to hope that this is a straightforward server outage that will be resolved soon. Your first instinct might be to troubleshoot the issue yourself. You might consider restarting your device, updating the software, or even restarting the Bluetooth connection between your smartphone and your Garmin device. However, it's important to understand that these fixes won't be effective in this situation. The problem lies entirely with Garmin's servers, not with your individual device. If you attempt to log into Garmin Connect during the outage, you'll likely encounter a message indicating that the service is currently unavailable. There might be a range of issues, from being unable to sync your fitness trackers and smartwatch, to not being able to log into the app, or access the web dashboard. The key takeaway here is not to panic or take drastic measures. Deleting the Garmin software from your phone will only create extra work for you when the service is ultimately restored. The best course of action is to continue using your Garmin device as you normally would. You can wait to sync your data when the service is back up and running again. This situation might make you question why Garmin doesn't store a copy of your data locally on your smartphone. It's a valid concern, but unfortunately, this seems to be an industry standard. The likely reason is to minimize the local storage requirements on your device. For those who want to stay updated on the status of the outage, there are online platforms that provide real-time updates on Garmin Connect's operational status. You can find the link in the description of the video below. Garmin also provides information on the status of all its servers. Again, the link can be found in the description of this video. While outages like this are undoubtedly frustrating, they also serve as a reminder to be patient and not to take immediate drastic actions that could complicate matters further. The most sensible approach is to continue using your device as you normally would and wait for an official update from Garmin.